You're watching Good Day Columbus on Fox 28. Hey, uh, make sure you stay with us this morning in Good Day Columbus. I'm really excited about this. Mm -hmm. uh, pretty incredible video uh, that we want to share with you a little bit later. A great program called Ampuski. Yeah. Uh, three folks, including my friend John Lawson, who is a, uh, a double arm amputee, recently did something pretty incredible. Um, you got to stick around to see this video. A very inspirational story, including a local woman, too. Uh, that is all factored into this. I don't want to give too much away, yeah. but you really don't want to miss this video that's going by. Can we allude to what ski part is? Basically, um, folks that are water skiing that you might think because of their physical limitations wouldn't be able to, and it's really just testament to the human oh, spirit. Oh, amazing. You know, uh, uh, I water ski, and I'm lucky to escape really with a bathing suit on. <laughs> <I know. laughs> the falls, I oh, think. Yeah, learning how to water ski can <laughs> yeah. be... An interesting thing. I'm really actually, instead of water skiing, I'm better at just kind of like skipping across the water. Oh, nice, like a That's, stone? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty good. Like, All right, coming up next on Good Day Columbus, a group of people who are not letting limitations hold them back. Yeah, stay with us to learn their story and the skills that will inspire you. Meet the wow. team behind this incredible viral video. That's next. You're watching one of the latest videos to go viral right now and talk about a truly inspiring story. What you're looking at right now, right off of YouTube, a video of three folks obviously water skiing, but what you may not notice, one is a double hand amputee, another is a double foot amputee, and the inspirational woman in the middle happens to be quadriplegic. Talk about inspirational. Three people who are not letting their physical limitations slow them down in any way. And uh, I'm excited to say that all three of them are joining us this morning here live in the studios. John Lawson, uh, as well as Stacy James, and joining us via Skype this morning uh, from Alabama. Woody Thornton is uh, joining us as well. We appreciate all of you guys uh, sharing this story with us. And Woody, I want to I start with you. You're one of the founders of this program that put this on called Ampu ski. How how did this all come about? Well, that was uh, several years back. We uh, wanted to have an event for uh, the group we have called Cast Ministries. Uh, we do a, a support group for amputees, and one of the things we wanted to do was to uh, host an amputee water ski clinic. So uh, when we started it off, it was you know strictly you know, targeted towards amputees. But uh, since then, we've you know kind of opened it up, and it's really just brings in anybody with disabilities now. And, uh, you know, truth be told here, I mean, John, you and I are personal friends yeah. outside of this. Um, and I know that in your situation, um, y you lost your hands later in life. And, Stacy, I know that uh, also this was something that happened to you later in life. Had either of you water skied before this? I had, yes. Yeah? I grew up on a lake in North Carolina. And before I bought a car, I bought a boat. So, I mean, the first thing I bought was a ski boat. So I've been skiing pretty much my whole life. And uh, I, when I lost my hands, I didn't. And it w when, until I met Ampuski about three years ago, or went skiing with Ampuski, it was the first time I'd been skiing in over 20 years. Yeah. So uh, it, it was a lot of fun. It got me back in the water. The water's a great equalizer. It brings everybody, you know, we're out of our element. So mm -hmm. uh, I, I love it. It's, it's, a great, it's, it's a great feeling, and it feels really good. And so. Stacey, when you learned about this, I mean, you know, what in you said, okay, I've got to do this. I uh, I water skied a little bit before my accident, but I uh, I love being outside. I love being active. So anything to do that, I always give it a try before I rule it out. I thought I might really love this. I might really hate it. I'll never. I won't have to do it again. But if I love it, then. And as far yeah. as the uh, the video goes and getting this out there, I mean, obviously the story is inspirational. Is that what you guys were hoping to accomplish? Is maybe to inspire others who have gone through similar things in life or maybe just to inspire people in general? Well, certainly. I mean, um, I don't think either one of us get up in the morning and go, I'm going to inspire somebody today, you know? <laughs> we're just living our life. We, this is right. what we enjoy doing. And, and so we're living our life no different than anyone else. But the video was a great idea. Uh, last year, Woody and I, with no feet and me with no hands, we decided to ski together. We made a little quick video. And this year... Uh, with Stacy, we added Stacy in the middle uh, in a sit ski, and uh, we owe a lot to our boat driver and our, our safety officer, Gar Bradley. Uh, he's a uh, 
water ski instructor with the University of Cincinnati and he came mm -hmm. up and volunteered his time and he had three different people behind the boat at the same time with three different types of limitations and three different ways to pull everybody up. Everybody's a little different. Well, I mean, I know that even, you know, just if you're not, if without any sort of physical limitations, you know, Woody, water skiing can be difficult enough. So what was it like with everybody in the water there? As far, I mean, we saw the end result with the video. Was it tough the first time you got out there to ski to try to get up on top of the water? Uh, it, it was kind of tough the first time, but, uh, you know, I was kind of like John. I grew up water skiing, so uh, I, when I had my accident almost 24 years ago, uh, I, you know, one of the first things I did was to, uh, you know, order a water ski instead of uh, before I even got my legs. So uh, it's something I've always enjoyed, and we wanted to kind of pass that along and, uh, use that to encourage other people with. All right. Well, Woody Thornton, Stacy James, John Lawson, guys, thank you so much for uh, sharing the video and your stories with us. We certainly appreciate it. Now, we have a link to the CAS Ministries website and more information on Ampu Ski. Just go to myfox28columbus.com. Look under the news link section. It's on the left hand side of the homepage, guys. Thanks again. Thanks, Pete. Thank All right. You. So much more to come on Good Day Columbus this morning.